Story Time. Evoluzione Radio. Dear friends, welcome back to Story Time. Today we are going to talk about Smile in English, an innovative school that helps professionals perfect their English and gain more fluency in speaking. With our guests, Anika Hossein and Lorenzo Pavesi. Hi guys, how are you doing? Hi Vera, we're doing great. How are you? I'm doing great. Thank you so much. So, um, uh, can you tell us a little bit uh, about your project? So, how did Smile in English see the light? Absolutely. So, it all started with my passion for teaching. So, I have been teaching for about 11 years before I uh, before Smile in English became a reality. Uh, it started about one year ago. And before that, I had had the opportunity to work with many different schools using different methods of teaching English. I had the opportunity to experiment with my own techniques and styles as well. So I came up with the idea of a very innovative method for teaching students. So I was picking and choosing what was the most effective uh, bits and pieces from my experience. And then when I met Lorenzo, <laughs> this dream of um, creating my own school became a reality. Yes, yes, I know. <laughs> is the potential of the idea of the mission of helping professionals learning English because I learned English and it became the most important skills that I developed in my life. It was so transformative that I do want people to learn it, I want to spread it and I believe that we can do it through a very simple and effective method such as the one that we're doing at Smile in English. And everything is in the name of happiness yes, right smiling, smiling yes, right smiling. so That's tell right. us uh, a little bit more about the real mission uh, um, of smiling english right so the concept of smile or sorriso <laughs> is at the heart of everything that we do so every lesson we have with students we try to make it fun for students so making learning uh, fun means learning without realizing that they are learning so our teachers are trained to create environments that where students students feel comfortable to make mistakes they have the opportunity to share their ideas express their yeah. opinions without the ju- yeah, fear they feel of judgment like ease. they feel at ease and they feel like they're having fun and once you're doing something that you like it becomes yeah. much easier to absorb the notions to absorb the grammar the vocabulary so it just creates a momentum that allows you to keep going until your level of english is satisfying Absolutely. So learning English in a, uh, let's say, uh, quite happy environment mm. to um, uh, arrive at the end of the day uh, and, and um, like feel uh, completely satisfied of, your, of what you have learned and what you are going to achieve that's on exactly these it. premises, right? Yeah, that's, yeah, that's correct. Yeah. That's awesome. So to get to know more about learning English, you can directly join Anika and Lorenzo via the contacts at your disposal uh, in the banner below. And of course, uh, don't forget to tune in for the radio interview that will follow this backstage. So guys, thank you so much once again for your time. It was thank a you. pleasure thank you for to, having us. Uh, to listen to you and till the next time. Wonderful. Wonderful. Have a good day. Have a great day. Story time. Evoluzione Radio. <laughs>